Guess what day it is today? <laughs> you guys, my baby, my miracle baby is one year old today. Yes, yes, yes. I'm so excited, you guys. I think I'm more excited than him. Mm -hmm. I definitely think I'm more excited than him. I'm whispering because he's sleeping, okay? So today's his birthday super excited you guys so happy for him so thankful for this gift of life this boy has brought so much joy okay this bit this boy has brought so much joy so much happiness into our lives so much laughter so much love and i really 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 I'm thankful to God for such a beautiful gift. So anyway, today is his birthday and yeah, we are just happy here. I think it's father cold midnight. <laughs> yes, it's cheesy like that. <laughs> to just like wish him a happy birthday. We sang for him and yeah, it's been it's been nice. The little sister, the young eh, not the little sisters. His sisters woke up earlier before they went to school and they sang for him it was so cute you guys it was so cute i i swear i almost shed a tear <laughs> to just see these people you have brought into the world come together love on each other celebrate each other it was just a really touching moment for me as a mother okay so anyway right now i'm off to town i just need to pick a few things buy a few things um we're just going to have like a lunch for him uh, i don't really have money like that <laughs> all the money that i had i put it back into my chicken project and the father was supposed to send me money but the money hasn't arrived oh my god this banks i did the set on my shooter anyway i just decided i was not going to let this day pass or maybe celebrate it on another day i really wanted to do it today so i just went ahead and ordered him a cake so we're just going to have a small lunch cut the cake sing for him and you know yeah that will be it uh maybe when i have more funds i'll do the photo shoot and you know do the whole thing but as for today today not today <laughs> we're just going to cut cake wish him a happy birthday and yeah just do those things so I'm about to head to town right now Say one. Stop eating those. 
Ethan is one year old, guys. Look at his cake. So cute. We wish you many more. We wish you many more. We wish you many more, Ethan. We wish you many more. One eternity later. Hey guys, um, today is a Sunday. I think I last talked to you guys on Friday. That was Ethan's birthday, right? Yeah, Friday. Yesterday, spent most of the day just chilling at home. I didn't do anything much. I think I only went out to Chicago, Maneru, and that was that. Not Maneru, but around four, five, and that was that. So tomorrow is Monday. Kids will be going to school tomorrow. So I need to prepare samosas for them. I'll just prepare them, put them in the freezer, and then tomorrow morning, the only thing I have to do, I'm eating popcorn, if you're seeing popcorn, the only thing that I have to do in the morning is just take them out of the freezer straight into a hot pan with hot oil. <laughs> so yeah, my kids don't like bread. I have tried. I have tried putting different things on the bread, you guys. They just don't like bread. I think Isabel is even better. Isabel will eat the bread. But I know she will just bring back the lunchbox at cities. Especially if you just, you know, lazy. it. I will try to put margarine and, you know, peanut butter or something. She won't eat it. So I usually try and mix it up for them in their lunchboxes. So I usually just make um, the samosas in bulk, spring rolls in bulk, freeze them and then uh, just fry them in the morning when I do not have anything to pack for them. <laughs> so I wanted to show you guys that process. I've already got my things here with me. I've got my all-purpose flour and then I also have, this is cornstarch or corn flour. Mm, this makes the samosas crunchy. So I usually just put a little bit of that, you know, if you just use, you can just use all peppers flour, it's still okay, but putting the corn flour, you know, makes it better, it makes it more crunchy. Corn flour is the type of flour that is used in all these fried foods, especially the fried chicken. If you want really nice crunchy fried food, try to put cornstarch in your chicken and that would be amazing. The next thing I have is just my tray. Uh, my flour tray. I also have my bowl and a whisk and then um, this cutting board. This is where I'm going to be wrapping my my samosas from. And then I've got my nonstick pan. Although you guys, nonstick pan yangu is getting scratched inside. So sometimes it sticks from here. You want a pan that is absolutely nonstick for this. I have tried to do this with other pans. It doesn't work so I finally bought this nonstick pan and then what's the other thing I've got my brushes here with me so you also need these paint brushes I actually went into a hardware store hardware shop to get these brushes so I've got two of them one for you know putting the glue on the samosas the flour glue and then this is for putting the flour into the nonstick pan. I will show you guys the whole process. And then uh, last but not least, let me just check on my pot I'm cooking. So last but not least, I've got my filling here with me. This is just chicken breast that I cut into small pieces. There's onion in here, there's spring onion. What else did I put in? A bunch of spices and Worcester, Worcester, Worcester star. <laughs> that sauce, let me show you the one I'm talking about. This one. How do you spell this? Worcestershire sauce. So I just put a bit of that into the filling and then I dry fry it with just a bit of oil so that it doesn't stick to a pan. So those are the few ingredients that I'm going to be using today to make the samosas. Sometimes I make beef samosas. That's if, if I, that's if I have um, minced meat. You can use minced meat. 
just be sure to dry fry it we don't want any oil a lot of oil in um, the filling because we're going to be frying the samosas and we also don't want any water or any soup of some kind so make sure you just dry fry it maybe in another video I'll show you guys how to make the filling but today I'll just show you how to make the easiest samosa dough you can make and yeah let's do that mama what's this called? cornstarch cornstarch like a moustache not like a moustache <laughs> listen I forgot the cornstarch moustache <laughs> Constance, Baba. 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 Big I want to record what I'm doing here. Big I need to buy a bigger tripod because I always have to bend every time I want to talk to you guys. Nobody else can try for the Anyway, in my bowl here, I'm going to put all purpose flour in cornstarch. Isabel, please move one. I'm going to so one hand. So I'm just going to eyeball it. You know me and eyeballing. I'm just going to put the amount that I need. So I've put in um, my all peppers. Next, I'm putting in the cornstarch. <laughs> Why is that funny, you little girl? Because it got mustache. Because there's endings. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Oh! Why is he making that speed sound? Okay, so I've put in my opipos flour and cornstarch. Next, I just need a little sugar. bit of sugar. This much. No. Good. And then I need a pinch of salt. Salt. Mustache. Mustache. Pinch of salt. Little boy, what do you say? Ah, Drusha Marie Pekeji. Huh? Ah, can I? Do you want to know what I'm going to do with you? So, I need to trade the fifteen dollars. Hey, my Erin. All right. Okay. Okay guys, so my pan is now nice and warm. So what I'm going to do is take my mixture and my brush and then I'm just going to brush around my pan and because my pan is nice and hot, it's sticking onto the pan already. So once I've brushed the surface like that, I put it on the stove and then it starts cooking. So I let it cook and once I see it lifting on the sides like it's doing right here, can you see that? I know that it's almost ready 
and it's time to lift it out of the pan. So I just gently <coughs> lift it out. Okay, so these are my sheets here. I've just put them on a flowered surface so that they don't stick to the surface. Isabel, So now I take a spoon of my filling, not too much filling because you don't overfill your samosas. Fold like this, then like this. Put my glue. Fold it upwards this way, and then now I make my nice triangle. I don't know if you guys can see that. And there we have it. I place it onto the tray, the flower tray, panimama masamusa, just like that. So I'll show you guys one more time. I've got my um what do you call this? <laughs> my wrap, my samosa wrap here. I put a little bit of filling just like that. Half it. Do that. Put my glue fold it upwards to the side turn it around put more glue onto this side you're basically just trying to make a triangle do you guys see that So let me do this quickly and show you guys. Maybe if you watch it for a bit, then you'll get it. If you've got any questions, leave them in the comment section. Shop here, Mr. Price. Okay. How much are those? So, Mama, my dear, you have No, Pani Mama, our food is right just now. Go back, my shoes. Eh, hey, yao. I would run. I can knock up for sure. Wow. 
ma so then the side the rema deco kwa tuma baskets eh tuma deco plants ito chukita mari Those are pretty. Eh. When I eat another salt. Eh. How much are those? Ah, for a cheap edge, I think. Uh, for a cheap edge, I think. Take it to the kitchen. Marty. Wow, are those cushions? Yes, my cushions. Hey, Vaskana, you look cute. Is that a dress? <laughs> yes. With a slit. My way. My way. Only my shoe. You look nice. See, I can see myself raging or drop and do I go and say. Hey, Vaskana. I foresee I it, huh? Hey, I like everything. I like everything in there. What come up plants are there? Pa, yeah, those ones. How much are those? I would want to get one for my house. They are nice. Yeah, they're nice. Now I can't see my price because they're so nice. Okay. Can I muna chida kuita machine orders with you? I need to say. I'm saying, well, how do they get in touch with you? Maybe pano angu ano ruko na pa chano yangu. Go ya ku ku Instagram and. Okay, ko is our ning is our kita is easy. And mama personal shopper they can do that. Famba neom shopu I see kura za jinu and then people buy. Me mark tower and yes, it's ninga tabu. 